Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Avis. Welcome back to another episode. Today we're going to talk about something very interesting, the President's Day Sale 2020. You know, it's pretty soon actually on the 17th or around the 17th of February and you guys really wanted to see this video. So let's start with the video. By the way, guys, feel free to leave a like and subscribe and especially a like so the video gets pushed into the algorithm and more people actually see this because I think that's pretty important because a lot of people do enjoy this kind of update or prediction videos about the sales. Keep in mind, this is a prediction video only. So nothing of this is actually confirmed, but looking at kind of the recent sales on Roblox, it's kind of actually fair to say that this might happen. So what could happen actually to the next sale? We have two possibilities, actually actually three possibilities, but one just doesn't seem like it's going to happen. First possibility would Roblox not doing any sales. Um, definitely not going to happen. Keep that in mind. That's That won't happen. I, I've seen some comments, hey, what about the sale? We didn't see any announcement. Is it canceled? No, that's not the case. Roblox always does a sale at least. Uh, they did in the past, so I don't think they're going to cancel one sale. All right, possibility number two, President's Day sale 2019. Uh, this could be possible that Roblox goes back to 2019 and kind of continues with this kind of theme of the sales with discounts, new items, limited, limited with stocks, um, items that come back and go limited and stuff like that that we all like. And we're going to talk about this kind of possibility in this video. And possibility number three, um black friday sale possibility whatever you want to call it and this is probably not the best one and a lot of people were frustrated with it because pretty much what happened is roblox releasing pretty expensive item for the majority of roblox players um 20 000 robux that's 200 dollars. so yeah a small timmy cannot afford this actually and let's be honest another item that costs 20 000 robux and another item for 12 000 and another item for 40 000 of course compared to the normal prices for those items they were fairly cheap but for the majority of roblox players this was not really affordable and even they had a long timer it was not really possible for them to afford it so it wasn't really a black friday sale keep that in mind because in the past we did receive discounts and stuff like that and there were no discounts in this one all right so let's take a look at this possibility first and in tomorrow's video i'm going to talk about this possibility what could possibly happen if roblox decides to go for this one and in this video we're going to discuss what's going to happen most likely uh, with this possibility right here so let's start all right so let's see how president's day sale 2019 was keep in mind um during this pretty much sale uh limiteds broke and roblox stopped making limiteds for quite a while so yeah, first of all, day one, we received some small items, pretty cheap prices, pretty good discounts, animation discounts, and something similar could happen this year as well. So Roblox starts on day one with like small items, then continues with like some discounts for packages or offer packages. Then on wave three, we receive some animation packages for cheaper prices, maybe some old packages like the the kind of old theme packages, not offer packages coming back on sale, like the, the really old packages from Roblox. And wave four, just some new items. And wave five, just finishing off with a limited item. So kind of cool. Could happen this year as well. Day two was a bit similar. Noob attack, so limited in the first wave. Pretty nice. Some more limited in wave two and wave three. And then in wave four, we received some items that went back on sale, actually. Um, some classic items, I guess. And this was kind of cool. So of course, we could see some classic items such as work clocks. Keep in mind, work clock headphones are 3,000 Robux and the shades are 10,000 Robux. And of course, there is no confirmation whatsoever that the work clocks series, whatever you want to call it, comes out in this particular sale. But I can kind of confirm actually that they're going to come out this year in general. Because like if you go actually to the work clocks, let's just search for them, work clock. Oh yeah, I cannot type work clock headphones and shades. We're going to go for in this case the, the headphones. Um, simply, okay, wait, we can actually open both. You can kind of see like uh, a theme going on in 2000, in 2015 they went on sale in 2016 2017 2018 and 2019 so you can definitely see roblox release them every single year once and yeah then for a different timer 12 hour timer 24 hour timer and then a three hour timer so you can see they kind of continue this kind of uh, tradition i guess you can call it that they just bring them on sale and you can see 2016 2017 2018 and 2019 so we've seen them in Labor Day sale, in Memorial Day sale, in Labor Day sale, in Memorial Day sale. So most likely Labor Day sale. Um, so keep that in mind that it, they might actually come out during Labor Day sale in 2020. 
just wanted to confirm this so we might not see them actually all right let's move on our classics of course uh, big hat bigger hat frenemy hat stack and a bunch of other things as well like traffic cone kind of counts as a classic item i guess as well the lampshade series and a bunch of other stuff as well like the antlers of course we shouldn't forget about those um they're definitely down here like silver black foreign Black Iron Endlers, sorry, Silver Foreign Endlers, Amethyst Endlers, and Adorite Endlers. And these ones actually went limited on that sale, so they won't return anytime soon as a normal item, of course. It makes sense, right? Uh, more items, and in general, the sale was just pretty nice. We did receive a lot of discounts, a lot of cool items, limiteds, and a bunch of other stuff as well. So this was a great sale, in my opinion. Even though limiteds broke, it was still a nice sale compared to Black Friday sale. But we're going to talk about that in tomorrow's video. So what other predictions do I have for this sale? Because this video is quite short right now, there must be some more predictions. Exactly. So let's have a look at my inventory because there's some items that we haven't seen in a while on Roblox and I'm actually thinking they could possibly bring them back. We have the Beast Modes Banana series right there. We have the red one of course, the blue one and then of course the radioactive one. Um, as well as some other face accessories if I'm not wrong, maybe not actually. Okay, never mind. Let's move on to the hats now because there's a few hats that could possibly come back um, maybe eventually as a limited as well um, but this is pretty difficult to predict so I'm just going to say they might return this year. Um, since they didn't return last year we have this one right there Crimson Perry Strong Crown that one could possibly come back. Um, of course we have some pretty ever pretty cool other items right there like the the lamp shade there this one could possibly come back there's a few of them so roblox definitely has some options there for items to pretty much bring back once again would be kind of nice to see that of course top hats could go on a discount um this one once sold for like 1.5k as far as i'm concerned of course we have the pinstripe fedora that one was like 700 to like a thousand robux so could possibly return as well we talked about those probably labor day sale 2020 uh, and then we have the poison horns of the whatever they are called this one could come back original price was 10,000 robux and a bunch of other stuff as well there's a lot of possibilities in every one of those lampshades if you want them they're pretty cool to collect i guess at least I'm just collecting them. I'm never really wearing them. We have the Ember Crystal Circlet. I'm still hoping for that one to come back. Silver Foreign Endlers, of course. Kind of like classic item friendly Fedora. That one is also kind of cool. I think that one is like a thousand Robux. So possibilities are endless for Roblox in this sale. Of course, we also have some faces. Red Clockworks. There's also the Blue Clockworks. The Festive Bucket. Probably not the best time for Roblox to release that one. Hot Pink Snow Fedora, or whatever it's called, could possibly come back. Traffic Cone as well. We have the Gingerbread Visor. I don't think that one is returning since it's not really Christmas time anymore. So these ones, maybe. There's the blue ones. Maybe actually the blue ones since these ones were out last year. Um, so maybe Roblox goes this year for the blue ones. Would be kind of cool. I would probably get them. Um, but I'm not sure yet. Depends on the leaks, of course. And then we have these faces as an example as well. So these faces as well. This one was like, I think like a hundred or a thousand Robux. I don't remember. And this one was like 10 Robux. And we have these ones that came out last sale during President's Day sale. Um, so they have maybe a possibility of coming back or going limited or something similar to that. And just in general, the possibilities for Roblox are actually endless for the sale. They have a lot of items to pretty much re-release or bring back a limit or whatever what they want to do with it and yeah this is pretty much my prediction video for now there's a lot of items that roblox could bring back and i hope this kind of give you like an opinion or like a first glance of the sale that could possibly happen but keep in mind if roblox decides to go for this possibility of going back to kind of like the old theme of the sales with discounts and tomorrow we're going to take a look at the probably reality of how roblox sales might be but I don't want to ruin the sale before it actually started. We just have to wait for the leaks. And if we're going to see a lot of items for the leaks, um, we can definitely see that this is going to be similar to this kind of sale. And if Roblox just releases like a few items, or better said with the leak pages, just to release like a few items or leak just a few items um, like this sale, then you know it's most likely going to be this, like, going to be like this sale. Sorry, I cannot talk anymore. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you tomorrow in this episode. Please feel free to leave a like and subscribe and also share this video so it get pushed out into the algorithm and more people find this video. And if it was helpful, feel free to leave a comment and of course you can discuss in the comments as well what kind of sale you might think will happen, possibility 1 or possibility 2. And of course possibility 3, which is no sale at all, probably won't happen. So yeah guys, thank you so much for watching, I'll see you in the next one and have a nice day, evening or whatever, and yeah, bye guys.